right, that's classy, classy, classy. classy. We're all about the class. I know, I know. Actually, you gotta take your book down, or I'm gonna freak out. So the next one you can bring it up. Yeah, I can have it wherever I want. Here, I'll show too. No, it's there. <laughs> no, right you're right. You're right. I don't care if it freaks you out, man. You're right, but like I have, I'm a it's control okay. freak. All right, I know, right, right. and you gotta get over it. I, why? If I no, think that's, that's like a necessary balance. Right? I know the fact it's that a, I am a like I and need me not to do playing that. into it makes it interesting. You're right. You're right. Yeah. No, it's a, it's important. <sighs> Welcome to another episode of Nerd Out. I'm Randy. This is Brian, and I we're here with. Marvel Legends ginormous series uh, Deadpool. Um, I had no ambition to get this. Uh, I was at the toy store buying a toy for my uh, my young fella, and uh, this was like what late. Toy? Uh, it was a, it was a remote control tarantula, and it's actually pretty creepy. Sweet. I like it. Yeah, it's cool. Um, I, I I have a fear of spiders. Like I I think it's natural, normal, but uh, tarantulas particularly are creepy. Um, I mean, I mean how spiders, can you, yeah, 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 I mean, you can't they're argue beefy, that. Meaty. Yeah, yeah, absolutely, and they're furry, like, they're just, the tarantulas just freak me out. Six so, uh, spooky, man. yeah, they are, they're spooky. So, uh, it, which is weird, because this was at, like, 7 in the evening, and Toys R Us uh, is a shit show anyway, they don't have anything in stock, but sitting there, just with a Captain America 12-inch, was the Deadpool. So I picked it up, and I'm like, I'm like, I, ha I, I don't know, I didn't, I was like, I wasn't looking for this, but like, how can I not get this? Like, I had a ten dollar off coupon. Uh, and he's hot. And he's, you know, he's yeah, hot. He's, he's a cool thing to have. Why right. not? You know. Right. Absolutely. Like, right. I'm not. I'm not in this to resell stuff. But I figured for for finding it, like the worst case scenario, I had at least four or five people I could have I could have given it to, mm. like, or, or you know, that would have wanted it. Like your brother, for example. I felt kind of bad, but I was like, anyways, I picked it up and um, first thing is I thought they were retail for forty, but they actually retail for fifty. Yeah. Um, know that. we'll get to that price, but man, uh, box, it's, it's functional. It's functional. I mean, what I else? I think that's a pretty nice box. It is it pretty is. nice. It's Window, pretty gold tint, or is that silver? Yeah, yeah. no, it is have like a, nice I think I put, art. No, it is. It's classy and simple. Yeah, You're right. It means a flap. I like flaps. I like but... flaps too, but that's like. That's like import stuff. Yeah, it's counterintuitive. Yeah, too. yeah, it like, is. You but don't I put a window box to cover it. Yeah, you're right. Oh, yeah. But I do like the flap. Um, so. I busted it open, and I got to be honest with you, it is one awesome action figure. Hey, like, it's not bad, man. Yeah, I'm, I'm not, I'm not the biggest Deadpool fanatic. Like, I like his look. I'm just, I'm just not into the. I'm not really knowledgeable of the character. I like the movie. Yeah. Um, yeah, I, uh, me too. I like the aesthetic of him, but like, I don't like the whole talking to the camera and the cheesiness of it. But I think he looks cool for sure. He does look cool. You know what my issue with him, and 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 I don't know if I'm right. But he sort of reminds me of like a Bugs Bunny kind of character. And I was never a fan of Bugs Bunny as a kid. Uh, which is weird, right? I mean, I think everyone liked Bugs Bunny. But like, Bugs Bunny always seemed like a dick to me. And he was a dick. He was. And yeah. I just, you know, I don't arrogant know. Arrogant dick. Yeah. yeah, yeah. It was sort of arrogant dick. And so like, I sort of think of Deadpool as like the Bugs Bunny of the Marvel Universe. But that aside, I didn't mean to hurt your feelings. If you, uh, I think he's awesome looking. He's got the Rob Liefeld pouches. Um, and this figure is like, that's a, that's a beefy bad. Yeah. Badass. I mean, this is a solid figure. Like for, if you get, if you're into Marvel legends, I mean, there is no reason that you wouldn't call this coming in under par I agree. for sure. I mean, it's like, it's easily twice the material, you know, and right. It's got good weight. Yeah. It's got good weight. It's got good articulation. It's, I mean, it's, it does everything. You know I mean, what? Other than paint applications, yeah. which it, they aren't bad. It is uh is no less than uh, Play Arts Kai, and a Play Arts Kai will cost you like a hundred and thirty yeah. bucks. So, again, I've said this a million times, but Hasbro uh really loves their their Marvel toys uh, and their they Marvel show fans. It, man. Yeah, they do show it. Um, I do have one. I have a, I have a couple complaints. Mm. Can we go for that? Go for okay, it. Okay, those man. guns and the holsters don't come out. That's kind of a bummer. That's chintzy. That's yeah. a little chintzy. Oh, yeah. Now yeah. both of those knives do. Hmm. Uh, but, but the, the gun's not coming out. They look like they would come out, right? Like, don't they look yeah, like... Yeah, which, I'll give them credit for that. They Absolutely. painted it. Right. At least it's not one solid piece. I mean, they did paint them to make them look different. I mean, yeah, that's sort of a bummer. Does it almost look like they're separate pieces, too? Or, or... No, they're just painted no, they're really just nice. Painted. All right. Well, in that part, it does. Yeah, they're molded really nice. Yeah, Because even are. the part, they, like, drill out where the gun starts and the holster ends and... It's, it's really nice. Yeah, no, it makes you think that, that they can Man. come out. But, I mean, I can handle that, but that would be... And then also, and you can tell me if I'm crazy on this. Um, the head, he comes with three heads. We'll get to the other heads, but that head looks a slight bit on the large side. For Liefeld? 
Yeah. You think so? I don't know if it does for a dude. Right. But I think for the art, because, like, I wonder... I don't know. I don't know either. Like, I, I mean, I think I'm just, like... I, I might be just... I don't know. It looks a little slim, or the head looks a little large. But you're probably right. It's probably very proportionate. Just for whatever reason, the way that it's done, it does look slightly on the large side. I think for the comic book art, it does, for sure. Maybe it's because his ankles are so thin. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, give him boots. He needs, like, more bulk on the bottom. It looks like he's wearing, like... Well, the uh, this one did. You like that better? I like Like that. the shin guards? Yeah, I like that more. I think I do, too. Um, that's that's very mm -hmm. reminiscent to Snake Eyes version 2, which yeah. is the best G.I. Joe figure, um, on our, arguably. And, uh... But I do like the bulkier boots. I think it looks better. I'll just keep this guy up there. He's uh, he, You can see how big he is. Um, he looks like very so 50s. Bit. Like his shoes oh. are very, like his jeans are rolled up and he's yeah, kicking yeah. a boot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, articula yeah, yeah. Uh, his swords are kind of uh, kind of tight. Okay. I guess I'd rather them tight, but like... Ooh, I'm, that's really yeah, tight. Yeah, isn't that really yeah, tight? That's, that's intense. It is, it is intense. The other one, not so much. Do his guns come out? Uh, His guns? Yeah. On this guy? I don't know. Not to change his, the subject? Uh, well, he's got a huge gun. He's huh? got... Yes, it All right. does. All right. Ooh. Which is kind of weird because... Oh, shit! There's, yeah, there's kind of no reason for this not to come out. Um, His swords, his knives do, and I respect that. Mm -hmm. Um, His articulation is... I don't know if you could ask for anything really better. I mean, he's got that... I, got I the actually, butterfly? He's got, is that what it's called? I think so. I like that joint. Uh, he's got the... the Ab crunch, and then he's got a, like a waist turn, which I guess is not a waist. What's a, the upper torso? Torso, yeah. And then uh, I, I really, other than maybe like toe articulation, which I could absolutely do without. I have no interest in it. Uh, he's about as articulated as you could possibly ask for. Like you can get him in like some pretty badass poses. Is this stand just for his head, or like can he go on it? It is. It is for that head, but pop Let's, that guy off. Okay, this is cool. Crazy. I, I don't know the, again, I uh, I like Deadpool aesthetically, but I don't really know the character well. And I'm going to get a lot of shit for that, but fuck you. Uh, his skeleton mouth moves, his little thing. Oh, that is spins. Ridiculous. Like, that's a detail, right? Yeah, that's, like, like, like wow, so he can fly? Yeah, yeah. he really flies. No. That's sweet. But that's... If he only didn't have that stupid thing, that'd be the best head. Yeah, yeah, but I think, oh, because it'd be like a... But I think that's part of the the yeah, character. I'm sure it yeah, is. And then yeah. he also comes with uh, the Wade Wilson, like. Don't hurt yourself. I know, man. You know, I, I've been I've been working out, and you think that I haven't actually. But uh, that's his like half. I you know what my one complaint is is, uh, it's not a complaint, but it's not really as grisly as he should. And that was my complaint with the movie, was that I thought that Wade Wilson should be more... Like blue? Yeah, you know, he should have been mm. so, uh, like, Freddy Krueger. I thought he looked pretty gruesome. You did? I did like, 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 I think it's like, when you take a face, he, he had no features. Yeah. Which freaks me out. I found that it, it reminded me of, like, Twilight Zone, the movie. Okay. The sister with no mouth. Yeah, yeah. Really made uh, me uneasy when there's no features. Are you talking about Wolverine Origins, or are you talking about, you're talking about the, thought, movie. the movie, like, his movie. You know what I thought he looked like? I thought he looked like, um, Ryan Reynolds a little bit, like... On more less on less handsome, so he's like still he was still more handsome than your average person. You, you know? thought he looked handsome? Yeah, I mean, I think I, think, I, like, I, I, thought, I, I, I thought he looked ill. I thought they could have made him more gruesome, like when uh, he was like, "You're not gonna like me," to his girl, yeah. and, uh, whatever. I I thought that, I think she would have been like, "Yeah, you are pretty rough, but you're still more handsome than the other guys in the bar." I think he was probably the ugliest. Like if I mm -hmm. if he were that that were real, I'd say he's probably the ugliest person I've ever seen. Wow. Without it, I, I mean, what, you think who's better looking than that? Not no, I don't know. I I don't know. I think like, that like yeah, yeah, yeah. the Freddy Krueger uh, makeup was more gruesome. Yeah. Um, I'm trying to think of like other really gruesome uh, faces, like because he describes himself as being like the absolute ugliest, like most horrendous creature, and like I still thought it looked like Ryan Reynolds with a little bit of burn. But I'm gonna. You're, you're probably right, I guess. And that's what that looks like. It's like, but I love how it looks like it's a separate. Um, yeah, that's really nice. That really like I love nice. it when they make it, like what you said. How they like separate like the the height or I don't know yeah. what to call no, it. You I don't. Got it. I don't know what you call it, but they actually like where it looks like it's torn material and not just painted over it. It looks great. They they yeah, nailed it. Um, they did nail this. Yeah. Um, here's another complaint. Um, 
for all of its good, like, I don't like these guns. They're too silly and cartoony. Um, I think if they were painted black, which I could just grab some paint and paint black, mm -hmm. I think they would look a little better. I think they would work better. I don't Same. know. Red, first Please. of all, red guns. And then they're too... They're, like, I understand we are trying to get away from realistic guns and toys, but I, I, I just paint them black. Paint them black. Do yeah, I'll think, give you that. I'll give you that. Do you think in the comic book they're like this, though? I mean, I guess I could do my homework, but... I don't... I'll bet it depends on the book. Okay. Maybe. I don't yeah. know. I mean, I've never, like, really well, read it. So, at uh, least these were gray, right? I mean, like, yeah. that, that would have been made me happier. Um, and then he's got, like, I was I thought it was a Spawn logo, but it's not. It's a close. Deadpool logo. It is close to the Spawn right. logo. Right. It's pretty funny. Um, and then, of course, he comes with, uh, again, a burrito, which the burrito is more detailed than uh, your standard Mattel DC Comics action figure. Alone. That's insane. That is right. insane, isn't it? Does he come with other... Check oh, it out. Okay, I was just going to... comes with a hand mm -hmm. just for the burrito. Oh, that's sweet. That's sweet. That's yeah. what I was actually just about to ask. Like. Yeah. And that burrito looks like it's almost real aluminum foil. Doesn't yeah. it? Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's got that, that... I mean, that's sweet. I mean, you could, like... Can I do it? Yeah, go yeah. for it. One thing I do want to tell you, though, be careful because the little cufflings... Yeah. They are separate pieces, and, like, they're bound to get lost to, yeah, by like I did. you. Did you just lose it? Not really. Okay. But you, you see it. But do you see what I'm saying? Like, if you were to get this, the likelihood is you'll lose a car. You'll lose one. And that's the same thing. Oh, you lost it. <laughs> you went under? I don't think All so. All right, we'll just, we'll just get it after. No, it didn't. It's oh, right, right here. Cool. Thank God. That was so scary. You would have been buying me a Deadpool. Yeah, I mean, I already broke your Punisher, man. I think we could like... do, like, a... a uh, edited episode of just the the different things that you broke or oh or whatever lost. I'm just kidding uh, I I did the I lost the Darth Vader belt that was a big thing yeah you can eat his I mean that is good. <laughs> like, yeah. that's good it's ridiculous but it's great that is ridiculous just for that that would be my favorite feature I think right no it's cool I would never display them like that but um, you wouldn't no because I mean I don't get the joke like, I don't I'm either, not but in on it just like but this is conversation right here like you guys yeah. Damn it. I don't, I'm not good. Where does it go? Oh, uh, which knife? It's either up there. Yeah, that No, one. I don't like that. I don't, I don't like that either. The, what's weird is yeah, there's yeah, one yeah. in his back, and it holds really tight. Yeah, what up? There's no of that. Yeah. Like, yeah. I mean, mm. there really isn't a lot to complain with about. Um, with all that said, I'm going to say this. I thought that they retailed for 40 and mm. so when I went to the register, I had a $10 coupon, which was awesome, but... When they told me a retail for fifty, I was a little. I think maybe it's my expectations were that it was a, a forty dollar figure. You know, it's just gonna go down. You gotta okay, fine. We're gonna do it like this. He's gotta sit. Oh, we can get him to burrito. sit. And then his burrito. You like, can tilt the leg a little bit. Yeah, that's what I'm doing here. Yeah. Just sit, eat a burrito. I mean, come I mean, on. That is awesome. Yeah, that's like. That is so awesome. It's fun. Yeah. It's it's fun. But uh, yeah, going back to the price, I think. Because fifty dollars is very reasonable. If you pay fifty dollars with it, I don't think you'll be unsatisfied. I think he's worth fifty bucks. I just think on U.S. toy shelves, forty dollars just seems right. Man, that would be so nice. Yeah, well, I mean, that would be. You're they'd right. be rewriting the way things go I know. a little bit. I'm trying I, I'm to. with you though. I'm trying yeah. to rewrite shit. But this would be a steal. Forty bucks. That would be like. I think Mer not Merry Christmas, mm -hmm, but that no. would put things where it should be. I'll give you a, forty just, bucks was, would put things where they should be. Yeah. Fifty bucks is reasonable. Yeah. Um, anything more is like if you if you find them at a toy show or something like that, and you paid sixty. Somebody's gonna I do that. Yeah, yeah. I bet yeah. a lot oh, of people yeah, are gonna do that. I think I think if you're a really huge Deadpool fan, mm -hmm. you're gonna be on top of it. Um, if you find them any cheaper than 40 and you hesitate, then you're, uh, even if you don't like Deadpool, you're making a big mistake. Like, that's the thing. It's like, ugh, I like the look of Deadpool. I just, I'm not like a Deadpool fanatic and I bought it and I like yeah. it. I thought you were going to hate it because I know that you have a thing with Deadpool and Harley Quinn. Harley Quinn, I hate. Yeah. You know, that I can't stand. Deadpool is just overdone for yeah. me right now. But he's cool looking. He's cool looking. Yeah. And, and I mean, the whole thing is... Like, I don't know, when something gets overdone, it always annoys me, and I can't help it. Right, like, like Wolverine in the 90s? 
Yeah, Wolverine. Yeah. That was one of the ones that didn't. Okay. But I get, I don't, you know, Wolverine. Like Pearl Jam in the 90s? <laughs> I, got I don't know, I don't know. I don't right. know how to explain it. I like, know what you're saying, yeah. But over, Harley Quinn. Just, over, no. too, overexposure, uh, oversaturated. Like shit that's always been there, but now people think it's good like 15 years later. Mm -hmm. and Yeah, no, I get what you're saying. I, I totally understand, Um, but uh, yeah, you got to get it. Sorry, sorry, Dave Kruger. Like, I really felt like bad that I posted pictures to you that like I got this and, and you were probably like oh just sell it to me but I, I, I can't resist I'm a crackhead like I, I that see, you are I no? see this and I pose the question do I get it am I gonna get it and we all know the answer to that question yes everybody knows the answer I was shocked you didn't buy those those transformers from Ben's uh, I'm glad you didn't, that. but that we're gonna talk about. Well, yeah. real quick, um, drop your price. Okay, yeah, no, crazy. no, I don't want to. I don't want to pinpoint anybody, but okay, I found the new Transformers Titans Return Deluxes, and I really want them. And they were at a comic book store, and they were tagged twenty five bucks. I would have paid twenty. They retail at Toys R Us for fifteen to seventeen, but twenty five was too much. Yeah, that was that was that was butt rape. That is, it was yeah. butt rape. They should have really been a little wanted. ashamed at that price. Yeah, I was, and, and I even said, I, I even asked them. I like know the guys. I'm like, look. Would you do the three for 60? I, I figured that was great. I mean, they're still, but from what I understand is they're paying almost like, because they, they get them through entertainment earth or something. So they're getting butt raped anyway. So, so. why get it then? That's uh, what I don't understand. Like, how do you sell that? I'll tell you why. Two years later for half price? Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, it's because honestly, if I did not get this Deadpool the, mm -hmm. the day before. You would have? I would have right. bought I mean, I would have at least gotten cup. I was actually, like, my mm -hmm. money, I lost I a know. bet to myself. I'm like, oh, he's totally. I haven't asked you after, so did you get him? Yeah. I thought you were going to at least get one. I was on the fence. I damn near almost PayPal'd you money to get me. Oh, the, my uh, God. I, uh, which one? Which, uh, uh, drift. No, which one? Twin cast or twin twist? Twin twist. That okay. one. You I actually one. thought that in person he was my least favorite. Which really? Which is really weird. Yeah. Um, the Perceptor looked the best. The uh, cup looks the most fun. But okay. the, the twin twist or whatever it is, he looked, a, his plastic looked a little off. But I still want okay. to get him. I mean, he's a brick, man. Yeah. Plus, he's a brick. Yeah, but... he is a brick. But it, I swear I swear to you, if uh, if I wouldn't have gotten this, I promise you I would have at least gotten Cup. At least. But, uh, yeah, this is a no-brainer. If you find it, get it. Um, someone posed, uh, said, hey, I, I'm going to just wait. And I'm going to find him on clearance for 25 bucks because that's what happened to the Captain America. Not this it's guy. not going to happen, yeah. man. Captain America and Iron Man, perhaps 25 mm -hmm. bucks. Spider-Man, 25 bucks. You are not going to find Deadpool on clearance for twenty five. But you'll still find him. I'll bet. I'll 50, bet you'll find him for fifty. Yeah, bucks. but it's not. But yeah, gonna, you're not gonna. It's not gonna get clearance. Uh, it, you know, it's just not. It's not gonna happen with Deadpool. If it does, it's because stores order cases of Deadpool specific. Do they? Does Does he get his own case? I think he comes with Captain America, which is really strange. All right. Um, but I, I. Oh, you know what? I think he comes with like a giant Groot. Oh, maybe not. Captain America is really nice. It too, is. Man. So is the Iron Man. Yeah. Actually, I like touched the Iron Man. Oh, yeah. I'll let you see it. I'll let you see it. It's great. Right. Um, I'll show it to you. Uh, the Captain America is great. But uh, I'm gonna actually get the Spider Man now because now I'm. Uh, you have to. Yeah. Sick old crackhead. Yeah, crackhead. But I think this line is done for the most part. I'd like a Wolverine, Tiger Stripe Wolverine. Dude, they, they should do both Wolverine. Yeah. But I, not the new costume Wolverine. I don't... No, the I, 80s, I want, man, with I the big the old red belt. Yeah, yeah the red belt underwear, man. Why would they not do Wolverine, though? I, I mean, know. like... These things sell like hotcakes, right? Yeah, and X-Men is a hot commodity again. You and know? they'll sell anything Wolverine. I mean, uh, as long as they do his cool costume, yeah. he sells, man. Yeah, no, you're right, you're right. So, if you find it, I'm telling you to get it. Um, even if you don't collect the 12 inch stuff, it's a cool action figure. I don't collect big ass toys. Well, robots, but action figures. Get it to don't. sell it even if you see. No, don't, don't, don't encourage that, man. Don't yeah. encourage that. Speaking of selling it, I'm going to pimp my toy show. I'm doing a toy show June 17th in Ferndale, Michigan at Go Comedy. It's called The Nerd Out. I no, told nice the story. name. I know, yeah, I, know. Not I got I asked permission. I don't know. It's because you're going to go and you're, you're going you to the to Nerd Out. It. I get it. Uh, cash Bar. Mm -hmm. It's going to be small and it's going to be fun. So if you're in the Michigan, Ohio area, come down and hang out. You can even come up here from Tennessee. You oh, think that yeah. would you I'd let you in, but don't mm -hmm. you think that would be a big drive? Like I think the expectations would be too high. Okay, don't come if you're from no one from Michigan, Ohio only other than that don't come. Maybe can't, maybe maybe Ontario. Mm. And uh, maybe Indiana, um, but no, it's, it's gonna be fun. I, I know. I feel like I'm underselling. It's gonna be a lot of fun. It's just gonna be a, a bunch of toy dealers, and we're gonna be nerding out, showing cartoons, playing some good music, and uh, I think this is gonna post before. If this does, 
uh, Monday night, April 24th, Realm of Collectors. We're, we're on that we're on shit. It. We're on it. Yep. Uh, as long as we get all the proper equipment to do it, which I think we're okay. Uh, we're on it. That'd be yeah. fun. So until next time, nerd, nerd out. out! Oh, P.O. Box. Do it again. P.O. Box. Send us. Oh, send. Oh, never mind. Don't send this. Oh, never. Next one. Nerd out. Nerd out. That was a mess.